Welcome to the very first Hot Tips video for the ModX Archicad content. In this video, we will demonstrate the initial steps of incorporating the ModX content in your Archicad project. You acquire the content through the ModX website via Downloads in the Resources tab. Scroll to the CAD file Downloads and fill out the form to request the files. ModX will then send you the following files an Archicad attribute file for the ModX specific building materials and surfaces, three favourite files for Archicad 21 to 23 containing the ModX assemblies, a sample Archicad 21 PLN file containing placed samples of the ModX products, which we will open now. The ModX Archicad library file and Swift Global's library for model view option controls. In this Archicad 21 project, Using the international template, we will demonstrate how to access the ModX content. First, we must load the two previously mentioned Archicad libraries. Viewing the ModX sample Archicad 21 PLN file, we can see all the ModX content in the 3D view. Some of these products are standard Archicad objects, which are utilised in the normal fashion while the railing products are assemblies of the Archicad railing objects and therefore slightly more complicated. Hence, we will demonstrate three methods for applying the ModX components and assemblies. Option 1 uses the library we loaded previously to give us access to the ModX components within the railing tool, so you can apply the ModX components to any railing system within your project. However, this does not automatically give us the complete ModX railing assemblies. And without knowing the product inside out, it would be a tedious task to try and create the assemblies. As you can see from the sample file, there are quite specific and complex configurations with the ModX range. So let's look at the next two options, which allow us to bring complete assemblies into Archicad without having to configure them manually. The first method is the very simple and fast copy and paste from the sample file to your project. However, this method has a negative side in that it will automatically populate your attributes with modex specific building materials and surfaces. In many offices, particularly the more advanced BIM practices, this is simply unacceptable. So we have created a final and impeccable method. Option three, whereby we use the modex favorites file to configure the assemblies supported by the attributes file. Simply import the favorites file applicable to your version of Archicad. You will have the option to import the complete ModX list or simply select the products you intend to use. With this method, you are not automatically importing attributes such as surfaces and building materials, as you have only loaded the ModX libraries and the ModX favourites, neither of which contain attributes. What this does mean is that where a favourite has nominated a ModX attribute, this element will either be missing or replaced by the attribute with the same ID. Therefore, we need to import the ModX attributes in the provided file by using the Attribute Manager. The important reference for the attributes is the ID, not the name. Therefore, if your template's building material and surface attributes are as per the international template, then the attributes once imported will assume the same ID as the file they were created in and therefore automatically populate the ModX favourites. Otherwise, you will have to reassign using the sample file as a guide. There are a few components within each assembly that you will have to do this for. However, it will only take one minute to achieve the perfect implementation of the ModX Archicad content, where you have easy access to all assemblies and complete control of your project attributes and processes. The ModX library has been carefully created by CADSWIFT to efficiently serve the needs of all Archicad users. We hope you enjoy using the ModX library for Archicad.